Father, in the name of Jesus, I give you glory. I give you honor this time ma, as I share your word, O oh God. Use me, O oh God, to be a vessel of honor this day, to be a blessing to somebody. How I pray that my reasoner and my viewer may have a word to be encouraged this day as I share in Jesus' name. Amen. My name is Florence Miner, welcoming you to yet another time of Celebrate Your Moment with Joy this beautiful day. God has given you the gift of the day so that you can rejoice. He has given you the breath of life so you can rejoice. Why? Because complain can dry the bones of our life. It can dry even our relationship. May God help us to choose, to change complaint to worshiping God and thanking God say surely were it not for God this is not something to rejoice about the title of my message will be turbulent moments in our lives if you have ever gone with a pain there are times that there are turbulence in the air and what happens is there is an announcement that we are going through turbulent moment there are bumpy areas I had to look for the meaning of the, of the word turbulence, and this is what it says. It's one, conflict, confusion, a time of political turbulence. When uh, now in terms of a vision area or other things in life, there is also this meaning. When air mo moves in an unsteady manner that causes a plane to bounce around and gives a bumpy ride, to passengers. This is an example of a turbulence. The other part I found among the many, because I was speaking part of them, when you experience a lot of unsteadiness in life in one way or the other, that's a time of turbulence. And I'm grateful to God because there is always a word for those moments that we feel so raw, we cannot understand things. Jesus speaking to his disciples wanted them to know that such moments are there we cannot deny turbulent moments in life John 16 verse 33 and I'll read says excuse me hallelujah hallelujah it says these things I have spoken to you that in me you may have peace in the world you will have tribulations, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. In times of turbulence, it's not time to deny. It is time when we get the announcements that things are not okay. When there, there is announcement of turbulence in the plane, in the air, when people are flying in an aeroplane, people fasten their belts and they are defied to fasten their belt. In less when we have those unsteady moments that are very, very hard for us. We can't deny there is a bumpy area. We are not able to function the way we are supposed to. We need an announcement. That's why you need a brother and a sister who can stand with you in those time of moments. Fasten the belt. And Jesus prayed for peace. Peace, unspeakable peace in times of turbulence. But we need an announcement. What does that mean? It means you cannot tell me that you can go through turbulent moment just keeping quiet. You're going to die of depression and stress. Turbulence is a time, turbulent moment are times when you hear the announcements and then you take a step. Jesus had to tell the disciples to encourage them. In those times of turbulence in life, you need an encouragement from a brother and a sister. And that's why time and again, I'll quote famous men of God, that no man is an island by himself. A pirate will not just take it for granted that there are turbulence in the air. There is something he'll do, and he'll inform the crew to announce to the passengers. May the Lord help you not to deny times of turbulence. May the Lord help you to know we need an announcement. May the Lord help you to know you need to start with somebody in times of turbulence. It could be turbulence of finances. It could be turbulence when you're going through divorce. It could be turbulence when you have lost a dear one. It could be tab a turbulence when you have lost your job. It could be a turbulence when your dear ones have left you. It could be a time of turbulence when your kids are just 
not doing what you're, they, they, you know, they're supposed to be doing according to your expectation. A time when you get that report from the doctor saying you have this and that, those are turbulent moments. May the Lord help you and me. You can have someone who can announce for you, so and so is not doing well, let us stand for them. Let us fasten the belt on their behalf. And the be fastening the belt will be in times of prayer, in times of intercession. It's time of give, being given a shoulder to cry on, giving your shoulder to somebody to cry on in those turbulent moments. That is a way of fastening the belt in this life. May the Lord help you and me so that we can know turbulent moments are there. But what we do during those times matters a lot for our health, both spiritually, emotionally, and even uh, physically. May the Lord help you and help me. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, help us to know that you have said that peace Peace will be ours when we call unto you. You are the Prince of Peace. Come and be the peace we need in times of turbulence. You in whichever way we could be going through those. In Jesus' name, amen. You are there. Turbulence of life have moved you from here to there. You have tried to drink. You have tried, oh, you have tried the drugs. They don't work. You have tried to do this one job after another. You have tried one career to another and it is not working announce it to the Lord and say, I am coming, take my life and let it be consecrated unto you. Do you want to say this prayer after me, Lord Jesus? I come before you. I realize I've been living in turbulent moment. I give my life to thee, Lord. Take it over, Lord. Guide me to read, oh my, to read my life, oh my God, in the way that you guide me, Lord, in your word. Give me a church where I can be able to grow spiritually in Jesus' name. Amen. If you have prayed that prayer, I want to tell you, your life has been transformed and you can take a turbulent in a positive way knowing that there is somebody who is who cares for you. you in those times you're not gonna just stay alone but you know an announcement is needed look for a church nearby where you live that teaches the full gospel without compromise for your spiritual growth when you got there again turbulent moments need us to get to, to, together we need to be together in unity it is blessed we are blessed we are encouraged when we are together may the lord help you i love you and god loves you most continue to share this message with as many people as you can subscribe to our channel if you have not done so visit our facebook page and like it and the lord will bless you i love you and God loves you the most. Thank you.